Hey, this is Drummer 251 and today I'll be showing you how to set up the Astro A40 audio system on a Mac. So, my Mac specs are, as shown here, I wrote them down, and I'm just going to pause this right now so you can read it. Alright, so, I actually was really mad when I first tried to hook it up into my Mac, <clears throat> because, like most of you would think you have to do is, take the the headset and plug in the 3.5 millimeter jack that comes straight out of the headset which is this one and plug it straight into the back of the Mac where the plug is right here this one which is the audio headset cable well that basically disables the microphone ability and only lets you listen to music out of there so I'm going to pause this and grab another cord so I can show you what I thought you had to do. Alright, so this bag came with the mix amp box and it was called the PC in cable from the headset. And basically you have to remove this part of the cable that comes out of the headset from here to here. You have to remove sorry, the other end so that your headset looks like this and then plug in this end here so that it looks like this and then the other end of this cord looks like this two cables one for headset and one for the microphone so alright I plugged that in I thought it would be perfect so the very left one here is the headset which would be the green one And then the one next to it, the one just to the right, says microphone or line in, which is the pink one. Alright, so that, it looks like it would work, but for some reason, Mac does not recognize this line in. Because, like, it's not powered, is what I've heard. The microphone's not powered by just that cable onto the Mac. So, what I found was that you have to actually not use this cable at all. It might work for PC, I haven't really tried it, but you can basically put this cable aside for Mac and take out the mix amp and plug back in the old cord that you use for playing your video games or on consoles and stuff. Plug it back in so it looks like this instead of the fatter one here with the regular 3.5mm jack at the other end and then what you want to do is plug in your mix amp using the USB cable that's provided only the USB into the top of it here and then the other end into any USB slot here and then plug in the end of the mix amp or the headset sorry the headset 3.5 millimeter jack into the headset spot and that's all you need so basically, you don't need, well, if your Mac can support an optical cable that has a slot, if you've added an audio card, then that would work. That'd give you surround sound. But for now, all you get with this is left and right audio since it's through USB. And I have to admit, it's not the best, but it, it does scratch a little sometimes. But if you turn it up, you can actually avoid hearing that. Um, and the microphone does work perfectly on it. It's super clear, but you have to turn the volume down all the way on your Mac. That's the only negative part about this is that the microphone is so sensitive on the Astro Mix Up when it's plugged into the Mac that you have to turn the line in volume down. But anyways, this basically shows you how to set it up on the Mac and now I'm actually going to show you on the screen how to go to the system preferences and then set it up so we can try it. So I'm going to pause the video and then resume at the Mac screen. And I have the Astros plugged in, as you can see, and it's plugged into the back of my Mac. It's on because the two red lights are on here. Um, right now, it's recording through the Mac uh, built-in microphone input. Uh, I'm sitting these down so you can tell whether I'm using them or if I'm using the Mac microphone. So right now, what I'm going to do is go to my system preferences, 
go to sound and you'll see here the first thing that showed up when I plugged it in was Astro Gaming USB Mix Amp type USB so what you'd want to do is click on it um, and then basically it would start showing up like talking so you can hear while I'm talking into there okay hold on I'll put my finger on top of the built-in input you can hear it's scratching hello 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 see that's the mix amp one um, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna stop the video switch it because I can't switch the audio while it's recording see this would be black otherwise if I could switch it while it's recording so I'm gonna pause it and then go back and just switch it to this audio and then go back and I'll re start recording again so yeah okay so I have the mix amp plugged in or the microphone on from the Astro A40s and as you can hear it's pretty scratchy like I can't hear it scratchy only because if I were to turn the volume up on the mix amp which is here and my game chat volume game voice yeah game voice volume is all the way to voice and my volume is to full so all I can hear is myself um, if you were to actually change it all the way to game you can't hear anything for, like if it were to be computer audio or games or other people talking you can't hear anything it strictly have to be only on voice and then you use the volume knob to change that but the volume knob doesn't change the uh, amount of voice volume that's going into the microphone only what's coming out into the speakers um, it is pretty scratchy I know so I was actually pretty disappointed the first time I plugged it in and I'm using the USB cable that's provided with the Astro mix amp and it was actually pretty good it's pretty thick durable and it was clear for using it on systems and stuff but for Mac it's not the best so I'm going to switch back to my uh, internal microphone and use that from now on so I'm going to switch back so you can hear what I'm saying alright so as you can hear um, this is back to the regular built-in microphone input in the Mac and it sounds super clear um, yeah so I guess both you and I could be both disappointed I don't know my opinion I really don't like the sound of the microphone on the mix amp but that won't stop me from using them to listen to music or playing games. I'll just still be using my regular built-in input or any other headset you have that you think is good. So, um, But this was just a video showing you how to set it up on Mac. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. I'd like that. appreciate that. You could either rate by thumbs up or comment or subscribe if, if you would like. Um, you could click on any of the links in the bar here or here. I'll have some links right there. Um, but anyways, thanks for watching. And like I said, don't forget to like, comment, or subscribe. So I'll see you next time.